Hello there, this is Marlena with A Pen and a Purpose, and I'm just going to make this really quick video for you in case you bought Nova Color paints and found that you don't like the jars like I do. Now it's going to be a little weird because I'm wearing my favorite clothes, so I'm not going to actually open any paints, but I want to show you how to replace these jars with something that works better. So what I found was these paints... So they get all gooky around the edge. It's hard to clean them. It's hard to close them. And I felt like I was never using them because I just didn't want to waste them. I only have so many palette knives and I didn't want to mix them up, etc. So I just had way too much stress about these paints. And so I never used them. So I decided to actually put them into some containers. And I did this about six months ago. And I wanted to wait a while just to see if it would wreck my paints and it has not. So I have two of these containers here in front of me. You can see that they have like on the bottom, they have it's kind of like a rubber silicone gasket. And um, when you buy these, you wanna buy the green ones because that's like the consistency of the Nova Color paints. But I wanna lay them out here like this. So you can see this one is this little size. So like I said, it's been six months and you can see it's still liquid in there. Um, so I, there's no issues. This one is this, uh, I think it's 16 ounce, one pint size. So it's the next size up and it fills it all the way. So when you fill these, what you're gonna do is you're going to take off the top so you don't take off this part you make sure that this is on Oop, i'm off the video so you don't take off this part you're going to take off the top so you make sure that this part is tight so that it seals so you're going to take off the top of this and then i bought these silicone funnels and you can see i use this and i bought a lot of these and i bought a lot of these okay so you take off the top stick this on here so that it goes in there and then you're gonna pour your paint and it pours right in there and then scrape out like the excess with these now I ended up buying something like two or three packages of these because I just didn't want to wait and I had probably like 30 of these paints to do and it was kind of a pain the cool thing about this is when it dries, this paint just peels off. And also when it dries, you don't really have to worry about it anyway. So I'm gonna link this stuff so that if you dislike these jars as much as I do, you can then get these instead. So I wish I would have changed my clothes, but I didn't. Um, when this squirts out, so you can't get like a teeny tiny amount but it's maybe like a nickel or a quarter-ish size. And so I don't feel like I'm wasting the paint. Um, I have, I've used I have the gesso, the Nova Color gesso in this one. I use it all the time, so it's almost gone. It was full. So no issues at all. It doesn't leak. It's been a wonderful solution for me. And so I just wanted to share it. And um, sorry for the mess. Sorry for the not opening of the paints. Maybe I'll record this again in the future. I just wanted to get out, it out there because I know they just had a sale. And you may have bought these paints and you may get them and be like, oh, these are awful. These jars. Um, and so hopefully you'll just use your paints more. All right. Well, I hope that's helpful. If it is, please subscribe for more tips. Thank you and have a great night.